for the upcoming legislative session. Courtney. Steve, leaders from both parties say with the elections behind them, it's time to work together to get behind this new legislature and Governor LePage. The governor now faces a divided state legislature after Republicans recaptured the Senate. The GOP gained, regained control, rather, thanks to incumbent victories and wins in several other districts. Democrats maintained power in the House of Representatives, but they'll be a few reps short after losing a few seats. The shift of power in Augusta has Republicans pushing for change. I think that the message was a couple of things. I think people want to go back to an emphasis on jobs in the economy, uh, cutting out government regulation, uh, right-sizing government, the, the things Republicans were starting to do in 2010 when we had the majority. And what I think happened last night is the Republicans had a better message that connected to the voters throughout the state. And we have to look in the mirror as Democrats and say, why is our message not connecting to voters? Alfond retains his seat as Senate president for now, but that will change. Republican state senators are meeting this Friday. They're expected to pick State Senator Mike Thibodeau as the next Senate president. Reporting live in the studio, Courtney Sturgeon, WMTW News 8.